Hey guys, Mr. Scope here, back with another video, and today we're gonna be showing you some stuff that you might, that you did not know, or might have known, but didn't actually know. I don't know what I'm saying. Let's anyway. Let's get into the video. Some things that you didn't know about this video. Okay, so this one you might have not known, but the the monkey village reduces tower cost or reduces tower cost and anything that's in its radius that's placed newly as you see this has been placed newly but this has not and this one's in the in the radius of the monkey village so it it sells for less cost Special agents, special agents provided in random missions actually increase the pro value. I guess you know why I have all these pros now. Yeah, by doing this. But I got the, I got the Redactyl legit, and also the Banana Farmer Pro. I got that one two years ago. But yeah, they increase the pro value by one. Each one. Kind of like normal. I'm gonna see. Yeah. Basically. As I know of now, using a missile tower, um, blade mailstormer, and a tornado, and a tornado, that can get the maximum power for the temple as you can see right here it shoots out a tornado a rocket and it shoots out blades but if you did the normal one then it would only shoot out it would only shoot out its own its normal rays so that's a good fact to keep track of but moving on to the next one Getting a technological terror doesn't mean that you have to get the plasma so it can pop lead, as I'm sure. Hold on, let me just switch it to last so you can see. As I think. Yep, you don't need to get plasma or laser blasts. It's already good. Okay. Oh, and did I mention the temple can target camo? While original super monkeys cannot. <coughs> so that's a good fact. Let's kill them with spikes. No ceramics can withstand. Okay, maybe they can. Yep, yep, okay, yep. I'm in sandbox mode though, so yeah. Moving on with the next one. An easy trick to do the the four to four wizard challenge is to use two to three triple dart mon two three triple dart monkeys. Just spam them. That's how to easily do the challenge. Anyways, I'm not sure if there's gonna be any more. I'm gonna stop the video if I don't know any more. You can do more than seven daily challenges, like I did 16 easy daily challenges. I think that's how I'm going to do the week. Because they don't reset. That That's the, that's the thing. They don't even reset. So I think I can just do the daily challenge without even having to like get that reset but yeah you can do more than seven daily challenges doing impoppable though doing like 28 impoppable challenge that would be hard but yeah 
have no internet, so I'm not going to be including Odyssey. But a thing to note is that you can donate money to, to your teammate in co-op mode. Something to be aware of is that it's 50 cash per attempt for extreme modes, but the main street and tire pits give more XP than the Blue Antonium Lab. Death Valley is extremely hard. Don't even try it. You only get the token on your first attempt if you if you complete 100 100 levels then only on that attempt you would get like a token continuing on or else i'm gonna end most of the challenge restrict engineers balloon chippers and submarines because they're newly added so if you don't see why there's any submarines or like Submarines, engineers, or balloon shippers, they cannot be used in in challenges that are that restrict towers. As you saw in Icy Valkyries just there. Oh wait, one challenge has it. I, I'm pretty sure that's the only challenge. Hold on, let me see. Yeah, look. See, there's the engineer right here. Submarine and balloon shipper. Anyways, I'll see you guys later. Bye bye.